breaking news now in the Trayvon Martin shooting case. ABC News reporting that the doctor who examined the suspect, George Zimmerman, issued a medical report saying that George Zimmerman suffered a broken nose, two black eyes, two cuts on his head, and a minor back injury on the night Trayvon Martin was shot. Zimmerman charged with second-degree murder in Trayvon Martin's death. It's easy, perhaps, to fake uh, cuts or uh, blood, but uh, a broken nose? Zimmerman bailed out of jail in the middle of the night about four weeks ago. He's staying at a secret location. This isn't the first we've heard of Zimmerman's injuries. They were brought up in court during Zimmerman's bond hearing, where the lead investigator admitted he hadn't even seen that medical report. I know that that is an injury that is purported, reported to sustain. I haven't seen any medical records to indicate that. Have you asked him for them? Have I asked him for them? No. Do you want a copy of them? Sure. I'll give them to the state. It's a more appropriate way to do it. Straight out to Natalie Jackson, the attorney for the Martin family. Natalie, thank you for joining us. Uh, late notice because this is breaking news. What's uh, the response of Trayvon's family to this new information of the medical report showing a broken nose? Well, good evening, Jane. You know, this. Uh, quote new information it really doesn't make a difference to our position and I think to the prosecution's position um, we've always known that some sort of struggle ensued and our position has always been that Trayvon was fighting for his life we know that had not um, George Zimmerman got out of his car with the nine millimeter gun and confronted an unarmed teenager nothing would have happened now, if we, as we talk about the release of this report, we have noticed some strange things. And what, one of the strange things is the fact that um, the re, Mr. Zimmerman sought, sought his family position the next day. And that's interesting because we know that paramedics were declined at the scene and um, they were sent back. There, there, was no injury, there was no significant injury for George Zimmerman there. Um, one of the other things that we know, we saw what George Zimmerman looked like 30 minutes after the confrontation. There's a video. And, and these injuries, you know, that we certainly didn't see them in the, in the video. All right, Mark Eichlarsh, quickly, I'm sorry, Natalie, I just, uh, quickly, Mark, your thoughts? I disagree with Natalie. Legally, this is huge. A broken nose, cuts to the back of the head, um, the black eyes, all consistent with his version, and I think that it may resonate with a jury and maybe even a judge at the um, hearing coming up um, concerning whether he was standing his ground. Morally, different well, story, but not legally, even sure there's it's going huge. to be a hearing. His attorney has not even determined there will be a hearing. Well, of it's course, there's going to be a hearing on standing ground, ground, Natalie. Does not apply to this case. No, he's going to. He's absolutely going to file right. the motion. Well, there's no we're question. We're going to agree to uh, disagree. We're out of time.